Howdy folks, we are back online, Niner Niner. We are gonna get in the water right about now. Catch us another fish on the crack and crawl, I reckon. Oh, that's the one! <laughs> that's the one! What up guys, welcome back to the vlog, man. It is an exciting day with your favorite unemployed valet attendant, man. We are gonna go hit some big waters. Possibly a spot I've been hitting a lot recently because it holds such big potential and I haven't hit much of the bank, but I'm joining forces with Torrance today. I'm gonna meet up with him. We are fishing until sunset. It is three o'clock Saturday the 25th of April. We're gonna try and lay the hammer down on a big. I'm feeling good. I think today might just be our day, man. We wanna catch a giant. We always wanna catch giants and we never do over here cause, cause I'm me. But we're gonna try our best. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Got some new Carl's goodies, man. We're gonna do an unboxing sometime soon. I'm thinking a rod and reel arsenal video. I've been getting a lot of questions on my favorite spring base. I got a lot of videos I wanna do. Comment down below, let me know what you guys wanna see. But for now, I gotta go gear up, load up, and get ready to hit this place, man. Because uh, look, you only got so many hours in a day and the big fish are out. Let's go catch them. Quick close swap, y'all. We are uh, loading up in the STI today. I'm about to drop this. Yep, it's falling. How to fit the rods with ease. Bam. Man, one video a day has got me uh, forgetting to fill up the gas tank. We got 30 miles until empty in the car, and the destination is 29.1 miles away. Looks like we're gonna have to stop for gas, man. I ain't got time for this. The bass are eating right now. That's more like it. <laughs> How did that happen? Pull up right at the same time. What's up? Sorry, dude. <laughs> I'm pumped, man. It's big fish time out here. Uh, Here's what we're doing y'all. We're traveling very light today literally just going in with some extra plastics an extra citizen in case something happens here And the rigging gets messed up. I got the pliers the line cutters in case we need to retie or uh, Put on another t-rig because we lose it and then the scale that's literally it We're fishing with the big swim bait gonna cover a lot of bank here today And then just kind of follow up with the craw or maybe start with the craw just see if we can get a couple bites. It's gonna be fun Hey guys Oh man, go on catch him, folks. I know you're gonna catch him. I know you're hey, gonna I'm catch him. Hey, I'm trying. <laughs> Just getting started. <laughs> I'll have to walk this thing down. We'll see what happens, man. Man, this is gonna be the tricky part is lifting him up if I get a bite. <laughs> Torch just said he caught a small one. Good news, good news. I'm assuming he's throwing that bottom bait. I saw him casting out there on the spinning setup for a while. Yeah, guys, I gotta take this off and rig the six. The nose is messed up. I need to uh, grab some of that mend it. I might get some of that on the way home, fix this baby up. Luckily, we have got a Citizen Six right here on us, emerald speckled. Just pulling that tag in through the Palomar so it's the only one that gets all burnt and squiggly. Main line stays fresh. All right, rigged and ready, downsize, probably get some more hits on this. This is the six inch, probably about two ounces total instead of three ounces. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was the fish. I'm like, get the one to fish back in. Like no, I'm try <laughs> <laughs> trying to get me a big one. That was a nice catch. Hey, thank you. <laughs> Torrance is on with fish number two. Oh, just got hit. First bite of the day. Yeah, dude, smacked it, but I just, I didn't even like hesitate. I'm getting a little bit, I feel like I'm getting better at just like chilling. Yeah. Cause you can't just, you can't just get smacked and then set it. Like yeah. they're either, either, either side swiping it or they're trying to eat the whole thing. So it's yeah. like, uh, yeah. Definitely got to stay calm too when they side swipe it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I just kept it creeping and he didn't, he didn't end up getting it. So I followed it up. With, oh, I was about to say, I followed it up with the crawl, but I didn't get him. All right. That's a good one, huh? That's better. You're right about Tease on with the crawl. Oh, dude, he might be halfway decent. Uh, be cool, be cool. Be cool, keep it, keep it cool, calm, and collected. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> about to say. <laughs> yeah, people will just, uh, they give me so much shit. They're like, oh, yeah, unless you get that reel and you need to use this rod, I'm like, get the hell out of here. That's the biggest one, though, right? Oh, yeah, for sure. Nice. I'm going to hit it. I appreciate you. What's your name? Devin. Devin, I'm Weston. Nice to meet y'all. Thank you very much. Yeah, enjoy your walk. Did you catch anything today? Uh, not yet. My buddy has, but I'm going for these big ones with this bait here. So have a good one, y'all. Thank you. Torrance is on with number four. There we go. Pretty healthy though. It's good fishing. Yeah, that's dope. That ain't bad at all, right there. Look at that line, bro. Look at that healthy fish. Oh, nice. 
spotted. Raking them up. Yeah, a few of them have been spotted out here. Yeah, like the yellow spot. Whoa, say what? Right? Yeah, on the fin here too. It should be. Is that number five? Torrance is on it today. Crawls are the way to go, but hey. I might throw the crawl for a little while and then finish off later tonight with the uh, swim bait. Oh, yeah. Like as the sunset hits, then start creeping this again. Wouldn't it be nice? Let's see if this mother fits in the backpack. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. <laughs> ha! Do the dance. Oh, sun. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay. dude, this man can't be stopped y'all. He's catching him on the crawl. <laughs> hey, nailed him. Come on, tell me it's good. Tell me it's good. It's a cat. Oh, he said this fight is unreal. <laughs> Wait, that's a, that's a crazy cat too. Look, the Guggen baits don't discriminate. <laughs> I'm about to ask the question though. What kind of a catfish looking thing is this y'all? He said, do <laughs> Okay. I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> oh, that was out of nowhere. Okie dokie. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> There's the three we've been looking for. That's a good fish too. Uh, that built, that might be three, yeah. Swole. <laughs> oh, ah! so awesome, Simmer down, yeah, cowboy. Look at these fat. Cow. Keeping them pinchers, man. That's how we do a Google baits out here. You know, 20 fish per bait. <laughs> Say something. <laughs> right below my feet, dude. I went like this. He said, okay. <laughs> oh man, that's a fatty. That's a pre-spawn honey right there. I'm, I'm guessing, dude. Look how he's built, bro. Yo, here, let's. Let me set this down and get a quick weight before we drop her back in the water because, you know, me and T, we in a competition out here. He's caught 10 fish. I've caught potentially the, the game winner. <laughs> right, that natural. Not tripping. There we go, guys. So we're looking at just under three and a quarter right there. Nice one. Solid one. First one over three pounds today. Get this thing back in the water. Let's go. Here's what we're rocking. Wu Tungsten quarter ounce weight with one of their pegs. We've got a Guggen Squad hammer hook. I bet you this is a uh, four aught. I tend to purchase that size, but now they're just mixed up in the 10 with the rest of them. Who really knows? And then a crack and crawl with the natural color, a little silver flash on the bottom. They hitting out here. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah I was throwing that. Here. Yeah. <laughs> I saw your videos. Did that. you? That's so cool, man. I appreciate that. Dude, okay, check this out. I just bought a Huddleston. It's the ROF5. And it, it, it floated. And and so I got I actually got a DM from a guy, and he said that Huddleston, it's not uncommon. This happens. They send out the wrong package of baits. Like, not on purpose. It just gets mislabeled. So he said you probably got an ROF0 with an ROF5. I know. I was like, dang it. Oh. Oh. I know, right where his little hole is too. He'll be back. Did you see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? He was swimming with it. All right, making me look like a fool, man. God dang. He's halfway decent. I'm like, come on, kid. Take that thing. God. All right, third hook set. There we go. That'll get it. Another one, man, about a pound and a half. Yeehaw. Out here with the crawlers, man, Ooh, getting it done. <laughs> Peace out then, kid. That's the one. Oh, that's the one. That's the one. Dude. Oh, that was it, bro. That was it. I should have let her line out, bro. I don't know how big. That was good, though, right there. Holy cow. 
Now that's how you take it like you take it like a champ. You just say, look, all right, retie, get back in there. <laughs> Damn. Oh. That's why I only use 25 pound fluorocarbon. <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> Dude, they're hidden today. Torrance said that one was a four. I'm not gonna say nothing. Oh, that hook said too. <laughs> <laughs> they just came off the hook. I had them pinned. Oh, yeah. That's surprising. We've had more losses. Dude, every big fish has freaking yeah. come off. So what we did is we just retied you guys. We had uh, a few fish on the line and although I didn't break off, I just want to uh, be safe. The line felt a little frayed, so just figured I'd snap all that off. Lost that bass right there. Re-rigged a new crack and crawl. Pinchers are on there fresh, pegging that weight quarter ounce. Let's get back in the water. Got a good one. There we go. Right there in that little corner pocket, man. Another decent one. Chill out. Chill out. All right. All polka dotted in here. That will do. Right in the corner of the mouth on the crack and crawl, man. <laughs> we rocking that wide video on the iPhone 11 Pro. Look at that fat little honey right there. Came in this little corner pocket. And uh, you know, we knew she was in there. We knew she was in there. We've been on the hunt. It's been slow and steady, but we got another polka dotted honey. Let's get this thing back in the water. Torrent's on. I don't know if he's seen it yet. We are yeah. catching him out here. Sick. Oh. The camera was supposed to be this way. Well, there went towards the fish. <laughs> <laughs> I found the spot. Most grass yet. Yeah, hopefully they'll work something out with you, dude. That's that. <gasps> big one. That was a big one. Dude, he came to the surface because I was bringing the crawl up right here. It was, it was like three pounds. It wasn't like five. But I saw his back at the surface and he was taking it down. I set the hook. He didn't have it. Got to be kidding. No, no, no. He just took the whole crawl. Whole crawl is gone. Got my tasty treats. Wonder if that bass would eat again because he just like took the crawl and ran. So he didn't really get hooked or anything. <laughs> Got him. Okay. I knew there was one in the grass. Oh, killer. I have a feeling he's not going to bite this again. Got him. Oh, this one's bigger. No, he's not. No, he's not. He's not bigger. He's not bigger. He's not bigger. He's okay. Oh, we got one in the same spot. I knew that. Oh, watch your reel. <laughs> <laughs> that one's halfway decent, man. All right, we'll take it. <laughs> it's a party. All right, guys, just for y'all at home, 
sitting on the couch watching this thing on the iPhone. That's the biggest one of the day. 3.24. The other one was like 3.15 or 3.20 or something. That's a solid three and a quarter. See you, bud. Howdy, folks. We are back online. Nine or nine or we are going to get in the water right about now. Catch us another fish on the crack and crawl, I reckon. Torrance is on again. This might be the smallest one of the night, and that's yeah. like, that's the thing, is we're not catching really any dinks yet so Very far. Slow. I mean, that's even a pounder. Healthy, dude, good looking fish, man. <laughs> How'd I let that one get away? I might try and hit this bank and see if it's worth a dang. I don't know. Got him. Little guy. Smallest one of the night. All right, right before sunset. See if we can't get a couple more. Crack and crawl is destroying this evening. Well guys, the bite has died down and the sun light is fading. Right under that there bridge and beyond, sir, is where it tapers down quite nicely. Wrapping up a crazy evening with a little uh, buzz bait action. Anyways. We out of here, y'all. All right, guys, back at the car. It has been an amazing day. Crack and crawl, beat down, man. Possibly the best Bagugan bait for springtime in existence. And literally, we just raked them up nonstop all day. Torrance was throwing a color that he doesn't normally throw. And he'll be linked down in the description, by the way. Check him out for sure. Doing big things in the fishing space. But I got to get home. Devin got some dinner for us. So I'll catch you guys on the next video probably tomorrow, man. Upload today. Let's go.